So here is the number one Bantamweight contender making his way to the octagon. Got to be some nerves here as he gets set to compete for the UFC Bantamweight title. No deny he deserves to be there. He's got the requisite win streak. He's got the finishes. He's got the popularity, the fan support. Now he needs the championship performance. We'll see if he has what it takes to unseat the incumbent. As he makes his way towards the cage, his preparation has been perfect. He is in fantastic shape, had an amazing camp, and he believes that he is in the perfect position to become the new champion of the world. As he steps into the octagon right now, he steps in with a champion's mindset. All right, just about ready to go with this UFC Bantamweight Championship fight as the champ makes the walk here tonight. And he certainly carries with him, Joe, the confidence of being a champion. He has successfully defended the belt now multiple times. The question is, as he gets older and the challenges get stiffer, is he still the number one 135-pound fighter in the world? Odds makers suggest that he is. We'll see what the underdog challenger has for him here tonight. The champion headed to the cage right now is in the groove. He is in his prime right now. His training for this bout has been perfect. He believes he has a solid game plan, and he's ready to step in here and retain his title. He is well prepared for this contest. Our tale of the tape for this Bantamweight Championship fight. More than five years apart, with similar height and some differences in reach. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out United Center in Chicago, Illinois. It's time around for the undisputed UFC Bantamweight Championship of the World. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a wrestler with a professional record of 30 wins, 15 losses. He stands 5 feet 6 inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. Fighting out of Porterville, California, presenting the challenger, Joe One Bell Mofo Soto! And now introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a kickboxer. Only a professional record of 32 wins, one loss. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. Fighting out of Tokyo, Japan, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed USC featherweight champion of the world, the Snipe. All right, this is for the championship. You can give me your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves, let's make it official. They touch gloves and we are underway. You ready to fight? Ready. All right, here we go. Five rounds for the UFC's Bantamweight Championship. Gonna be very- oh! That's it, he's out, that he's out. strike here to end the fight early in the first. Yeah, we're just getting going, and now the fight's over, but excellent striking technique to land that shot and ultimately finish the fight here in the first. You've heard us say it before, but sometimes when you catch a guy cold before he's had a chance to get going in the fight, it can have a bigger effect. It certainly did here tonight. Let's see it again. Look at this. Boom! And then he's out. And there is our UFC Bantamweight champion proving tonight that he can get...